Dearest Lucy, if you're reading or listening to this letter, I assume you're getting married. Such a terribly sad time that I can't give you away in person on your special day. But you know I love you more than anything else in the world. All those years of traveling all over the country gave me so much pleasure. Watching you perform, I'm so proud of what ever happens you're still my little star. What a lucky, lucky man to have such wonderful children and their partners and children. I don't know how big their families would be by now. Just be happy in life, Lucy. All my love, Daddy Chalkley. I, Lucy, take thee, Richard. To my wedded husband. To my wedded husband. To heaven to hold from this day forward. <sighs> to heaven to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For better for worse. For richer for poorer. For richer for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love, to cherish, mm -hmm. and to death us to part. <laughs> to love and to cherish, to death us to part. To our part. <laughs> I, Richard, take thee, Lucy. To my wedded wife. To my wedded wife. To have and to hold to from have, this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better for worse. For better for worse. For richer for poorer. For richer for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death has two parts. Till death has two parts. According to God's holy ordinance. According to God's holy ordinance. Therefore I plight thee my truth. Therefore I plight thee my truth. life. It just took me a long time to find him. But when we met, it was like we recognised each other, like we already knew each other, and we already loved each other. This love thing was way easier than I'd ever expected. I'd really, as a lot of you in this room know, wasted a lot of energy making things work. 
but now I didn't need to. Um, life can be really hard going. It sort of whirls around you and sweeps you along on a quite a bumpy ride. But there is nothing easier and more natural than what we have together. Our love calms the craziest, craziness of life and I'm truly blessed. Um, I heard this somewhere, it's not my own words, but uh, the past is in our pockets, the future is in our hearts, and we are stood together in that tiny moment between the two. And whilst we're there, we're unbreakable. Ooh, it's better with you. Uh, as you all know, I've had cancer, uh, and you've all seen the you know, large scar that's hidden away today. Um, I've not really spoken to many of you about it. Uh, it's quite hard, uh, and I've either not spoken to you about it or I've made some ridiculously inappropriate joke. So I kind of figured that this was a time to be open and honest and then just move on, leave it all behind, and just get on. So um, I don't think any of you know that actually I'm undergoing a number of uh, surgeries to slowly become a pirate! <laughs> and, uh, soon we will set sail when my eye is fully closed and I have a new leg. Bluebell, why are pirates called pirates? Because they are! I've had the honour of knowing Richard for the last 26 years. When Richard asked me to be his best man, I think he was practising for his proposal because he got down on one knee he gave me those big puppy dog eyes and begged and begged me to say yes. <laughs> yeah. May the 7th is a day to remember. If the independence of Greece was recognised, the city of New Orleans was founded, Germany signed an unconditional surrender at the end of World War II, but in 1974, the world changed forever. <laughs> Even at a young age, Richard's generosity was evident as he left all the family good looks to his sister. <laughs> Growing up, Richard's always been keen on acting, mainly because of the dressing up. You can see him here uh, heading off to a local school disco. <laughs> Richard is an enigma. He is by far the unluckiest, luckiest man I have ever met. His confidence. His confidence. The positivity. And inspiration. His confidence and positivity are an inspiration to me. And I'm sure all of you a fantastic friend, a wonderful father, I'm sure he'll make an outstanding husband. So please, everyone, charge your glasses, be upstanding. To the bride and groom. To the bride and groom.